Hey, what's up, guys? This is Max Shuas, and I want to give you a little piece of advice. I've been thinking about this a lot. Um, my buddy Matt made a video yesterday, and it was all about uh, basically it was selling sales, you know. And there's a thing about sales that you all got to realize, okay? And for one, it's just like um, sales in and of itself, like the, the term sales, the term salesman, the, the, the idea of a salesman is, is very negative to most people. You know what I mean? They, they, they think of the, 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 I'm trying to sell you something person. And what I've come to realize, cause I've been, I've been doing uh, basically direct sales now for the last 12, 13 years. Um, before that I was doing a lot of like New York club promotions where I was like a street promoter and I had to go out there and, and, uh, basically hustle. You know what I mean? Like we, we got people to go to parties. We were doing that for three years. We were in some of the biggest events in New York. Um, but sales in and of itself, okay, let's just, the term sales, I don't know if you can see it or not, you might be getting a reflection. Okay, the, the first thing you got to realize about sales is that no matter what you're selling, okay, people are going to buy you before they buy anything else. You know what I'm saying? I don't think I've ever met a customer of mine or sold anything to anybody in my line of work that didn't like me first. You know what I'm saying? And there, there's a thing with that. And it's just like, you got to realize that like every single person out there, okay, first off, everyone can sell. Not all of us like to sell, you know what I'm saying? But everyone can sell. And whether you realize it or not, you've been doing sales from the day you were born. Okay. You know what I'm saying? When you needed something from your mom or your dad and you really wanted that, you know what I'm saying? You had to sell yourself. You had to sell the idea or the concept to your parents for you to get to, to borrow the car or to, you know, to get that extra cookie or to, you know, to get that extra, you know, dessert or, or just, just whatever. You know what I mean? Like a lot of times, like any of the friends you made, any of the girlfriends or boyfriends that you ever had in your life, any of the relationships you ever developed, listen, they bought you before they bought anything else. You know what I'm saying? They had to like you. They had to like your vibe. They had to like your energy. They had to like basically what, what you were bringing to the table. And that's the weird thing about friendships. That's the weird thing about relationships. That's also the weird thing about sales. So what you've got to realize is, is it's not, sales is never about the product. You know what I'm saying? Sales is always all about you. If you're selling, you know what I'm saying? And you're, and you're just in constant like you know, uh, I don't want to call it like sales mode, but like pretty much like all you're doing is, is like basically a, in any relationship you ever built, like you're always marketing, you know what I'm saying? Any person you meet, any whatever, listen, they either like you or they don't like you. You know what I'm saying? They, they either, they buy you or they don't buy you. And that's before they buy anything. You know what I'm saying? Whether you're doing online sales, internet sales, you know what I'm saying? Face-to-face -face sales, retail sales, car sales, whatever. If they don't like you, they're not buying from you. You know what I'm saying? I've literally walked out of restaurants before. I've walked out of places where I was ready to buy. And just because I didn't, I, I caught the wrong vibe from the bartender, the server, the manager, the salesperson, whatever. I just kind of, I was like, whoa, whoa, dude. No, listen, I'm, I'm out of here. And then I found some other place to go basically buy what I was looking for. Because unless they're looking for something absolutely specific, you know what I'm saying? Like a lot of times they're buying from you. They're buying because they like you, you know what I'm saying? There are a thousand other people out there selling a thousand other products. What's going to make them buy you? What's going to make them, you know what I'm saying? Do business with you, you know? So, so that's the whole thing. So part of this is, you know, in my business, we call it attitude, but really it's just like, it's your energy. You know, people have to vibe with you before they buy anything from you. They've, they've got to like your energy. They've got to like what you're about. They've got to like, you know, not necessarily so much your image or whatever, but you know what I'm saying? They have to buy your energy. You know what I'm saying? If you're, you know, all over the place and you're super hyper, you're going to attract super hyper people that are like, all right, man, I can relate to this guy. If you're very mellow and calm and straight to the point, and you're going to attract people like that. You know what I'm saying? If you're very skeptical and you're just trying to see, well, I'm not really sure, but I think this will work. Well, listen, you know what I'm saying? Nobody else is going to think it's going to work either because if you don't believe it, nobody else is going to believe it. You know, so that's the whole thing. It's just like when you're when you're trying to make friends, when you're trying to do this, when you're trying to sell something, whatever, you have to have full belief in what you're doing. You know what I'm saying? You've got to believe in yourself and you got to be, you basically, you, you either exude confidence and you're saying you let people know what's going on and they buy it or you're just like, you're just another, let me tell you about my product. Oh boy, it's a great product. 
Nobody wants to buy from a product rep. You know what I'm saying? Unless you actually need that product. You know, realistically, it's like how many times have you bought something from somebody that was selling something? You didn't really need it, but you really like the person. You know, I, I always just put it like this. It's the Girl Scout cookie example. There's a thousand, you know what I'm saying? There's probably millions of kids every year that go out and sell Girl Scout cookies. One girl's sitting there. She's sitting there. Would you like to buy the Girl Scout cookies? Excuse me, ma'am. Excuse me, sir. We've got Girl Scout cookies for sale. Would you be interested? And, I mean, she looks depressed. She's, you know, she's probably out there sweating. Her mom's making her do it. Her mom's sitting there behind her just, like, texting on her phone or something. And they've been out there for four or five hours, and they sold two boxes, right? And then, literally, at the other end of the shopping plaza, there's a little girl that's, like, jumping up and down. Hey, guys, check out my Girl Scout cookies. These are the best thing mints ever. Who's selling more? They're selling the same exact product once you know, go, getting the contest stuff and getting the bonus stuff, and the other one's just sitting there feeling all depressed because she's not selling anything. They're selling the same exact product, but one, you know, saying, I guarantee you, more people are buying the, the really excited girls, Girl Scout cookies compared to the other girls' cookies. It's the same product, though, you know what I'm saying? But what they're buying is her energy. She's fired up, and it's really hard to say no to somebody that's, that's that excited. It's real easy to just <sighs> pretend you're on the phone and walk past the person that's not excited or just you know if you're online you just you know just click the X I'm not that interested I'm not you know it's really not anything I want to watch because you're boring me so that's what you gotta realize you're gonna attract who you want now don't get me wrong the little girl there she's still selling some stuff but she's getting the people that can't even that are just tired of waiting in line for the really excited girl and they just want to buy a box of cookies they want her product She's only going to sell a couple. She's not upselling anybody. She's not getting anybody by multiple. She's not selling a case of cookies. You know? And she's like, uh, well, I sold five. Where the other girl's like, I sold 250. What would you rather be? What would you rather do? So just realize this. Everybody can sell, but you got to realize it's not the product. It's always you. So when it all boils down to that, it's like, listen, everything you're doing in life is selling. Every business out there offers A, a product, or B, a service, or C, a combination of the both. You know, saying which one does better. I can guarantee you this. It's not necessarily the company that, that, that that's selling. It's the advertising agencies, the media agencies, the marketing agencies. It's the people that get out there, you know, every hump day. You know, it's one of the best commercials out there. Because, listen, you, it's a camel and it's funny and ha-ha, it's a camel. What does that have to do with insurance? Absolutely nothing. But you know the commercial, so therefore, bing, all of a sudden you like the product. Crazy how that works. So just if you know how to incorporate that into your life and into your marketing and into your sales techniques or just or just into your day-to-day -day, like interactions with people listen man, i'd rather be known as the crazy guy that's just like yo dude that guy's a little weird but he's funny compared to the who who are you talking about i you know i see that guy every day but i don't remember him because he's boring anyway food for thought something i wanted to share with you on this beautiful tuesday uh this is max Uhas. i'm signing off love you peace out Live your life, live your dreams, don't be afraid, and get out there and sell because you're doing it anyway, but do it properly. Talk to you in the next video. Subscribe to my page. Sign up. Love you. Peace.